Okay, I found one thing, and uh, it's actually this. This is a good piece of glass. I think it's Blanco because the bands around crackle. Um, kind of a melted pontal, um, and it has the stopper. But one of the things you have to worry about when you buy glass is this. Now, the stopper's not in horrible shape, but and I didn't see this inside. So there's. I don't know if you can see where my thumb is. There's a crack where the stopper is, a fracture. That's an actual crack. That's not like part of the crackle in the glass. Um, I mean, it's still good. It's still decorative. It, it's like there's nothing really sharp or whatever. It's not missing anything, but it's got a crack in the glass. So that will affect value, unfortunately. But it might still be worth listening because I think this is probably like a $75 piece of glass with the stopper. If it's not, if it's if it's less expensive, if it's thirty, I'll just take it to the street, uh, flea market, and whatever I get is what I get. Uh, but there's a good chance that even the stopper by itself is worth twenty five bucks. Uh, and uh, if this is like a thirty dollar piece, I might just sell the stopper and then blow out the flea market. You know, blow out this at the flea market for whatever amount. You know, just sell a different. Um, just either put a different stopper in it or whatever, because at that point it won't matter. Look at this, it's all like freaking, uh, yeah. trash now. Yeah, I know. Stoppers should be expensive if you're replacing no something. What they used to be. Yes, it's all food. Well, no, oh, well, there's there's Planet Sun there's tanning. Tanning, yeah. barbershop. I mean, I, you know, it, it is summer. So it's, all like... it's either hygiene or, or making yourself look good or, or, or eating. What do we got? Yep, bake shop. Bakery. That's an Jewels, bakery. That's gifts, sweets. Goffins, whatever. Kebab on the Cliff. Rutherford Coffee Company. Yeah, whatever. Um, I like I like the, the brass roof on that bank. That's a bank, yeah, right? Cool. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Nice well, old building. I don't building. Know if it's a bank anymore. Yeah. But um, here, even the, the stopper, it, it looks a little rough, but I don't think that's really damaged. I think they just kind of pumped it out and ground it down a little bit and and that's the way it is you can see there's actually like a bubble inside of there so and the top is good normally um the tops will be snapped off i could probably snap this off if i wanted to oh, what's um, this? they're that oh, fragile the oh that's out. cool i mean that's that might be covid leftover you know wow look at that with the flowers yeah that's nice i mean as long as it looks nice there they took some of the sidewalk and did it again I mean, a lot of, a lot, in Manhattan, I think they were taking away. Look, they're building something there. But, all right, that's the one thing we found so far. I'll just see if it's good, uh, but whatever. All right, so I, I just found it. They have one in green on eBay, same exact, same size and everything, $155 and 17 plus change shipping. So about 170 or so, to $172, something like that. So I guess I'm going to put it on eBay. I'm not going to start it off at that much. Um, probably I'll start it off at 60 bucks and see what happens, right? 60 bucks because it'll cost like probably 15 or so to ship and you know, whatever. Um, stopper alone ought to be worth 30, so I don't know. You know, it this will display great. I mean, it's got a little bit of what you call it, it looks like on the inside. Maybe that'll clean, I don't know. But it's might as well put it on eBay. If I take it to the flea market, it's going to be 15 dollars tops, you know. So, I mean, we're trying. All right, um, are we almost at another sale? Yes. Okay, all right, we're going to another sale, bye. Uh, I mean, you know, it's like, who even thinks ahead lately, you know? I was uh, just, you know, every day getting up and doing something. I know. And listing things. Anyway, um, I spent $30, and I got eight spawn figures. And I think, did the guy say 60 at first? You know? Or 50? And I was like, nah. I, I, mean, I was like, I'll tell you, I... I have a lot of experience with spawns. Unfortunately, they don't sell for a lot. So I wound up paying about a little less than $4 a piece, which I guess he didn't care. He said these yeah, were the ones. got tricky and then when tried to charge you He was like, okay, more. so so far, $40. bucks. i am like, no, nah, you said 30 You know? He was like, oh. And I said, yeah, remember? Because I was like, I I'm kind of wanted to pay 3 bucks a piece because I just sold I just sold about a... Uh, let me see, how many... I think I sold... Let's see, 10, 20. All right, if I sold, if I sold 40 for five bucks a piece, that'd be like 120 bucks, right? No, wait, wait, hang on. 
my, my math is great. Five times ten is uh, fifty. So I must have sold thirty. I must have sold at least thirty or more for five bucks a piece, just to get rid of them. And that's what I'm going to do with these. I'm just going to take them to the flea market. I'd probably not even this weekend, unless I put them on my lap to fit them in the car. But so there you go. Um, unless there's a winner in here, which I'm sure there's not, because this guy looked up everything. He said these were the beat up packages. Oh my God, did you hear him say that that crystal pitcher was worth $400? I'm like, I know. Okay. He just, he's one of those guys that. He had the jewelry marked like crazy, right? Yeah, but he probably screwed up. He probably, like, you know, sold some gold by mistake. Oh, that's gold. I need at least $30 for that bracelet. Oh, no. He'd be surprised. Uh, he'd be surprised. He that's gold. gold. Even if it was a bracelet, he goes, that's gold. I want $100 for that bracelet. You go, okay, here you go. You know what I mean? Especially if it has weight. Uh, who's this? I'm not even wearing my glasses. So I'll just show them to you. Uh, this is not going to make me a lot of money. Unless I do it this If I say $10, 3 for 25 right? Then I will get, let's see, 6 is 50 Six is fifty, and then I could do another two for fifteen, so probably seventy-five. So I, I, at best, I'm looking for a straight up, probably relatively easy, double, double in my money, and I got one more to show, and that's it. AJ's gonna be like, "Why do you even buy that? We just sold them all for five bucks." I'm like, "Yeah, but the guy had a, uh, he had buckets. He said, see all those buckets there? That's Batman, more spawn stuff." So I'm like, "Okay, all right, you know." So, I will make money on this. So, you know, sometimes you pay to get a lead. You know what I mean? And you pay you pay to get the other stuff, which might be better. All right. Anyway, that, that's what I got today. Unless, we're going to get some food. We're going somewhere to, for, to get some food. Probably uh, where the Walmart is, Teterboro. And now my hands are dirty. And it's like... Um, so, what... Probably, unless I get something, uh, unless something comes into the store, this, that, this is probably it for today. I found nothing. I know you. Yeah. Look at this. Uh, we, we actually, we got all the lights in the store fixed today. We're all good. Okay, massive improvement and uh, save money. But this is uh, something that came in today. Yeah, well, you could see stuff. Zelda, Spirit Tracks. And uh, we got a guy who did a good job. I never heard of this game. Spyro, okay. Uh, Super Mario 3. Nothing too amazing here so far, but decent stuff. Um, okay, greatest hits. I doesn't have the boxes for it. Darkstone for PlayStation. And I hope this is the good one, right? What is he going to do? Death Trap. Is that a good one, Death Trap? I'm not familiar. You just push the plastic on that one for the one in the back. Oh, okay. Yeah. Sounds cool. Good and then, idea. And then he's going to add, add lights. All right, bye. All right. Uh, we got this from Whatnot, from our good friend, Mr. Pretty Daddy. He comes with the king to the store. See what we got. I'm sure it was a pretty good deal. I don't know why I actually did this this way. I should have just opened it. I thought it'd be cool to just open it. Let's see how he wraps his stuff. Wow, he doesn't even use bubble wrap. Okay, well, no, he doesn't. Silver Surfer. Spider Man. No, it's fine. <laughs> That's for a discount. Okay, so we got an Iron Man, Fantastic Four, Silver Surfer, Spider-Man, and a Wolverine. Thank you, pretty daddy. Bye.